chance to do it. Oh, singer! <laughs> Training and mentoring Afghan National Police, or ANP, is their mission. Coming home safe is their goal. Comanche Company 470th Armor Regiment from Baumholder, Germany, with a few weeks until they go home and days from handing the reins to the replacement, are still doing their job. Oh, uh, well, it makes us feel great. Honestly, we, all of us go out and we think of a new day. Each day is a, a new day of going out and training something, teaching them something they've never learned before. Drive over it with your motorcycle. On these last two patrols, their goal was to teach the AMP about something very dangerous, but not uncommon to this country. We can't be there all the time. There's about 20 checkpoints, give or take a couple, here in our area, and we can't be at every single one every time. At any given day, two or three checkpoints can find an ID. It's happened before. We reacted to five IEDs on one day. So we'd like to train the AMP so that they are able to handle the situation on themselves. The responsibilities placed on the AMP are increasing every day with a drawdown of coalition forces in the area. And more dependence is being placed on them to protect themselves and the people of Afghanistan. Countering improvised explosive devices or IEDs is an important part to their ability to safeguard their fellow citizens. In the area, there's a huge IED threat, and uh, we've seen a lot of AMP, local nationals, ANA get hurt. So, hoping that they can utilize and uh, save lives and themselves um, is, uh, is great. Once Comanche Company is home, they can look back and know they help the community better protect themselves. After years and then progressing, that uh, it'll pay off and uh, be able to look back and, and appreciate what, what we've done here. Reporting from Forward Operating Base Hadrian, I'm Army Sergeant Jason Procious. <laughs>